You're not making any sense. Han's planning a field test. They're going to use the super soldiers to destroy their Indian headquarters as punishment. When? It may have already started. I'm on my way there. Alert the police and tell them not to try to fight back. Just evacuate the area. All right. But be careful. And send an intercept team to the Antarctic facility. Armstrong is still there. Consider it done. No, please! <laughs> making any sense.
behind me. Control. I'll turn you into jelly. Help me, someone. Uh -oh. I look forward to this. It's a 
is someone. about Magnus Armstrong. What is it? Is he all right? He's in custody of harm. Not for long. Is this the information on the super soldiers? Everything I could find. Oh dear. Your glasses? Again? I think I left them in the cafeteria. I'll be right back. says.
armed and extremely dangerous. I've just been told that the intruders appear to be fine. I will smite you! Now I have you, eh? Is this the information on the super soldiers? Everything I
I see you! Now I have you! Now you're in trouble! I better get help. Have you seen a blue envelope? No. Why? No reason. But if you find it, uh, let me know. Is someone there? I'll be happier with that. Let's get the spy! You've given yourself away! I said so! For sleeping. Goodbye, my friend. I'll find you. This I promise. <laughs> Thank you, Where is my weapon? I better get help. <laughs> funny.
I'll be happier with backup. Have you seen a blue? Somebody's here and we didn't invite them! I am a poor one to prepared to die! Now you're in trouble! Get up! I just dispose of this. There's no escape for you! You're in for it now! I'm a 
imagining things.
Impressed? You're hired. It's an entry-level position, but I think you'll find the salary and benefits very competitive. Welcome to Harb. You should wash your hands with hot water. Are you the new secretary? Hey there. Lovely day.
tell you, the woman is driving me crazy. I warned you not to marry her. Not my wife, you idiot. Her mother. She was so sweet and friendly up until the wedding. Then she turned into a vicious demon. All she does is complain. Maybe you should remind her that she's living in your home. Are you crazy? Is she kill me? I'm thinking you need to be more assertive. You don't know this woman. She's dangerous. You work for one of the evilest terrorist organizations on the planet. If anybody in your household is dangerous, my friend, I think it must be you. You know, when you put it like that, the logic suddenly becomes clear. How can I repay you? Don't mention it. I hate to see a good friend emasculated. I'm suddenly very tired. No! Armstrong is waiting for you. Ask for it! I'll find you! 
This I promise you! But the boss doesn't know what...
good. The door's bad from the other side. Stand back. I'm gonna ram it. Somewhere. <laughs> Nothing. I shall explain. Where did no. you go? Eh? Where are you? Damn it!
mais tu dames, mon ami
mine. You can't have them. The girl must be punished. I'm seeing to it personally. Damn you! Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll report this to the director. I report this to the director. <laughs> Make sure he leaves. Now. Not so fast, Frenchie. Bad. Hurry, I'll drive, you shoot. Oh. <laughs> Run tight! I shall strike you down! on him. Hold tight! Sharp turn dead ahead! Not like this! Up on that balcony! Be so lucky next time. We're running out of time. Finally, some good news for a change. All this diplomacy crap's giving me a headache. Our agents are closing in as we speak. I hope so. You really impressed me back there. Listen to you, Clay. All you had to do was grab him, you dumb orcs. Clay, Clay, Clay. Well, at least you got his coat. Maybe he'll freeze to death. Oh, oh. <laughs> Shut up. Make me. Excuse me, Agent Archer. The site should be just beyond that ridge ahead. What's that smoke? Aunt Phyllis tells me you still haven't called her. The woman is lying on her deathbed, and you can't be bothered to make a telephone call. Mother, Aunt Phyllis used to keep me locked in the cellar whenever you sent me to stay with her. If I'd known what an ingrate you turn out to be, I would have locked you in the cellar too. Don't expect me to hold your pass for you this time. You have to stop him. 
is out of control. No! I'll wait.
be strong. <laughs> Subject were fine, but that one, that one was different. Hey, what's going on over there? Can you get through? You don't want to know. You must go. Bad guys are coming. Many helicopters. Let them come. We're not leaving without Armstrong. Forget about me. We're trying to stop a war, remember? Send help! You're not making any sense. Han's planning a field test. They're going to use the super soldiers to destroy their Indian headquarters as punishment. When? It may have already started. I'm on my way there. Alert the police and tell them not to try to fight back. Just evacuate the area. All right. 
but be careful. And send an intercept team to the Antarctic facility. Armstrong is still there. Consider it done. No, please! Are you okay, Archer? Yes. What's the situation? We are still evacuating the area. If your men can keep the soldiers busy, I'll see about getting those people out of there. It is locked. There's nowhere to run.
Someone! Archer. Someone! for you. 
Miss Archer, I'm glad you came back. I have news about Magnus Armstrong. What is it? Is he all right? He's in custody of harm. Not for long. Is this the information on the super soldiers? Everything I could find. Oh dear. Your glasses? Again? I think I left them in the cafeteria. I'll be right back. Are you, are, are you actually talking to me? Wow!
As you can see from this diagram, I got it all figured out. You give me 12 hours, I'll give you Mother Russia. Not a very detailed plan of attack. We can work out the details later. The first thing is to get El Presidente to sign off on the idea. Let me know what he says. Hello, Agent Archer. General Hawkins was just explaining his plan for invading Russia. Of course, he left out the part where he describes what actually happens during the invasion. I don't know about you Brits, but us Americans ain't gonna sit on our muffins waiting for the bomb to fall. I'd describe how the plan works, but it's kind of technical. It'd go right over your pretty little head. Why don't you stick to swapping recipes and leave the thinking to us? On second thought, why don't you and me ditch this joint and discuss this stuff in private? If and you know what I mean. Too bad his zeal isn't matched by his intelligence.
I'll get you! Remember you, I do not like this!
There you are. I was worried you'd been kidnapped. Ah, you found them. Sorry to alarm you. Some strange small person popped into my office and I thought it better to run away. Commendable plan. Let's take a look at those files, shall we? Must you fidget? Yes. I should think I can come up with something helpful. Of course, I'll need to analyze the data more thoroughly, so why don't you run along and blow something up for a while? Good idea. I'll just pop out and rescue Armstrong. Mm, have fun. Hmm, Armstrong. Straight up! Trouble at the office? Bunch of damn girly men ain't willing to do what needs to be done. No, you don't want to listen to my problems. On the contrary, I'd love to. Thank <laughs> you. 